My name is Jim Miller, and I am the father of David Miller. Uh, so uh, back in uh, 2018, uh, when my son and daughter-in-law told me that they wanted to open up uh, a new Catholic school called the Chesterton Academy, uh, the, my first thoughts were that they're kidding. After they explained uh, how they were going to do it, I told them that I would support them in any way that I could. I, I attended Catholic schools, uh, grade school and high school, and two of my sons uh, attended De La Salle. So uh, I'm, I'm familiar with Catholic schools, so I've always been uh, supporters, a supporter of the Catholic schools, and, uh, and I supported schools, and I also attended Mass regularly, so all my life. So, so then uh, I happily volunteered to support the Chesterton Academy uh, financially by being the first donor. So if you saw one of the first brochures that that they had, I paid for it. I'm impressed by the good start that the Chesterton Academy is having at St. Luke's. And I'm impressed by the students who are working so hard uh, on difficult classes. So now the future looks good for the school and the future looks good for the students. And I will always be able to support their, the school. Remember, O oh most gracious Virgin of Guadalupe, that in your heavenly apparitions on the Mount of Tepeyac, you promise to show your compassion and pity towards all, who, loving and trusting you, seek your help and call upon you in their necessities and afflictions. You promise to hear our supplications, to dry our tears, and to give us consolation and relief. Never has it been known that anyone who fled to your protection, implored your help, or sought your intercession was left unaided. Inspired by this confidence, we fly to you, O Mary, ever-Virgin Mother of the true God. Though grieving under the weight of our sins, we come to prostrate ourselves before you. We fully trust that, standing beneath your shadow and protection, nothing will trouble or afflict us, nor do we need to fear illness or misfortune or any other sorrow. O Virgin of Guadalupe, you want to remain with us through your admirable image, you who are our mother, our health, and our life. Placing ourselves beneath your maternal gaze and having recourse to you in all our necessities, we need do nothing more. O Holy Mother of God, despise not our petitions, but in your mercy, hear and answer us. Amen. <laughs>